Let's take another look at a stoichiometry problem. The same setup with the same equation. So this time let's do a mass conversion. We're given 200 grams of oxygen and we're combining that with an excess of ethanol. And I want to know how much energy will be released. So once again let's read this reaction. It says one mole of ethanol will combine with three moles of oxygen to produce two moles of carbon dioxide, three moles of water, and release 1,371 kilojoules of energy. Given that balance equation, when our data is given to us in grams, we have to first convert our data to moles. I'm given 200 grams of oxygen. And remember, oxygen is diatomic, so the molar mass is going to be 32 grams per mole. So I'm going to say one mole for every 32 grams. And that's going to set me equal to 6.25 moles of O2. Just like before, we can check our work by canceling out units. Now that I have my data in moles, I can take my 6.25 moles of oxygen and find the energy. Because according to the balanced equation, there are 1,371 kilojoules for every three moles of oxygen. Canceling units, moles of oxygen cancel, moles of oxygen cancel. And my calculator gives me an answer of 2,856.25 kilojoules. Checking my sig figs, it looks like I need to be in three significant figures. So I'm going to say 2,860 kilojoules of energy.